This morning, we have the story of a young athlete with serious grit. She's only a teenager, but has big dreams. And she's proving there are no obstacles that she can't overcome. Meet 16-year-old Amanda Merrill, a junior in high school, a varsity basketball player, a typical teenage girl in every way but one. When I was two years old, my parents discovered a bump on my leg. We went back and forth to the doctor and they just said, no, she's fine. So I was like, I know that there's nothing wrong, but can you x-ray her leg? And they did. We got that phone call the next morning. Doctors discovered Amanda had Ewing sarcoma, a rare type of bone cancer. Here's a healthy child one day, and then the next day, you're sitting in an oncology wing. It was like a dream. It was crazy. After six rounds of chemo, doctors had no choice but to remove Amanda's left leg. It was the day of surgery when we were wheeling her down. Her dad turned to her and said, you know what, Amanda? Your sick leg is gonna go away and you're gonna get a new leg and you're gonna run with your sisters. And she lit up. After the surgery, Amanda had eight more rounds of chemo and several close calls, but then a miraculous turn. I'll never forget it. For her third birthday, spent in the hospital and she got pneumonia and got really, really sick. I told the doctors that it's this her time and they said, you know what? She's a fighter. And fight she did. And eventually, she went into remission. Adjusting to her new life with a prosthetic leg wasn't easy. When I first got a new leg, I could learn to walk and to run. So that was a struggle. My um, parents signed me up for like anything that I wanted to try. I just loved sports and tried everything I could. Over the years, Amanda played lacrosse, soccer, and her favorite, basketball. I kind of had to like find a different way to do it. For basketball, I had to put my leg behind me and shoot because I can't bend it. Amanda hasn't let anything or anyone get in her way. There was one school we competed with last year. There were people in the stands heckling and teasing her, but she didn't bat an eye. She came down the court and drained a three. He was awesome. <laughs> we get those people wrong and like see their faces afterwards. Like, dang, she's good. For Amanda's mom, her daughter's story is a lesson in living life to the fullest. Every time she gets out on a court or something, it makes me nervous. But I know in my heart that she loves to be out there. She's just an inspiration to all that meet her. I just want to like show everyone that does have prosthetic that can't stop you from doing something that you want to do and achieve your dream. <laughs> Amanda hopes to play basketball in college, maybe even professionally one day. That'd be great. We'll be right great back. Great story.